Hi everyone, today we're going to be doing a full review and demonstration of the Dyson V12 DTEC Slim. We're going to be going through all of the machine's features and all of its included accessories. We're going to be seeing how well it performs on carpets and hard floors of different pile heights of carpet. We're going to be seeing how well it works on upholstery and cat trees. And we're just seeing how well it works above the floor like on dusting. So. We're gonna go over the included attachments with your Dyson right now. So these are all the included accessories with the V12 DTEC Slim Extra. We have the new anti-tangle power head. You can see that right there with the anti-tangle brushes on it right in there. Hair removal veins. It also has this texture on the brushes. I mean on the brush roll. We have the hair screw tool. This is designed for removing pet hair and allergens from upholstery and stairs. It uses this corkscrew style brush roll which pushes hair off the end through this little suction opening and into the machine. We have the laser fluffy slim cleaner head. This is for cleaning all of your hard floors and it has Dyson's laser which projects a beam of light on the ground so you can see hidden dirt. We have the extension hose, which extends like so for cleaning harder to reach areas. We have the usual attachment. This has been included with Dyson's for years, but then we have these two tools. These are only included in some models of the V12. This is the crevice tool. We have the dusting brush. This is the special crevice tool. It has the ability to flex like this and the ability to remove the brush as well. That's for cleaning harder to reach areas. We also have this new dusting brush. It's super soft and it has this little thing right here, which if you can see, has these little red veins that clean hair and debris off the brush. We have the wall mount, of course, the vacuum itself. There's some big changes in this machine versus some of Dyson's older machines. Instead of having a trigger, we have a power on off button, which powers the machine on and off instead of having a trigger. A lot of people have asked for that. I think it's, I'm kind of neutral on that. It doesn't really bother me, the trigger. I'm okay with either a trigger or a button because the vacuum is fine either way. And of course, we have this copper colored wand and the tool storage attachment for the wand. So now we're gonna get onto the cleaning test. We're gonna start with kitty litter on a low pile carpet. So the first test for the V12 DTEC Slim is gonna see how well it removes kitty litter from this low pile carpet, low-ish, medium-ish. So we're gonna turn the machine on, on its auto or medium power setting. And as you'd expect from a Dyson, it's doing an absolutely superb job. It's just leaving a few small particles behind. Doing an unbelievable job at cleaning. As you can see, the Dyson did an excellent job. He was able to clean up all of that dirt really easily. I'm gonna zoom in on the carpet. You can see there's basically nothing left. Look at that. It's so clean. All right, so next, we're gonna test how well the machine works on pet hair on carpet. So now we have some pet hair on the carpet. We're gonna see how well the Dyson picks it up and how much gets stuck on the brush roll versus actually going into the bin. So 
So let's check the brush roll. So as you can see, Dyson's hair removal technology worked very well. There's very little fur left, just a little bit of fuzz on the brushes and that's it. Super impressed. <laughs> Had no problem cleaning up all that dirt and hair. So now I'm gonna go empty this vacuum because it's pretty much completely full. And we'll be right back because I have some more tests. So we have three different materials to simulate different particle sizes for hard floor cleaning. We have rice, cream of wheat, and some crushed up chips. Let's see how well the V12 Detect Slim cleans up this material. We'll be using the laser fluffy head. We'll gonna start off with the rice. Easily cleans the rice up in one pass. Cream of wheat is in one pass. Nothing left. And the chip crumbs instantly cleans those up. So if you have hard floors, the V12 Slim will do an excellent job. There's one piece of chip left. As you can see, the DTEC Slim did a fantastic job of picking up that fine dirt and material on the hard floors. Nothing left. So I think it is time to check out the other attachments. So now we're gonna test the hair screw tool right here. Have it on auto again. Look at that, you can see the tool in action as it's actively removing that pet hair. Look at that, that's awesome. Let's see if we get this big clump. Just enabled the higher power mode. But you can see how the hair screw tool easily removed all that pet hair. I'm gonna remove it from the V12 and we're gonna look at the condition of the brush roll. And as you can see, basically spotless brush roll. Excellent job from the V12. Now we're gonna check out some of the other attachments. All right, so here we have this dusty ledge you can see. We're gonna see how well the Dyson new dusting brush works at removing that fine dust. Look at that. Look at how unbelievably quickly you see it. Look how unbelievably quickly that dusting brush is removing dust and all that dust. Now gone. I did an exceptionally good job at that. Removed all that dust instantly. So quickly and easily. I'm super impressed with that dusting brush. So next, we're gonna try it out on hard floors. All right, so I was able to think of a test for the crevice tool that would demonstrate its ability. We're gonna clean underneath my food processor. So normally, with the crevice tool like this, you'd be limited because you can't stick it all the way underneath, but because you can twist this crevice tool. You can now put the vacuum flat like this and go underneath and clean like that. Now there's nothing actually under there because I clean under it pretty often, but that's how you would use that tool. That's really the only test I could think of because I just did a lot of cleaning about a week ago and there's not that much dirt. But that's the test I can think of. So I think it's time, I'm trying to think of what we've done so far. Done carpets and hard floors. It's probably time to wrap this up. So this Dyson V12 is pretty fantastic, as you saw. It was able to deal with all the tests really easily, pick up pet hair, dirt on carpet, dirt on hard floors. The attachments are great. Everything I reviewed on this machine is really good. I'm trying to think of any cons. The only con I could think of would be the price. But on the other hand, it's not overpriced. There's a lot of copycat knockoffs of Dyson's that cost a lot of money, almost as much as this, for a copycat knockoff product. So, I really, really like this Dyson. It has every feature you'd want in a cordless vacuum and more with plenty of attachments for every type of vacuuming need you could have. 
love this Dyson and I continue to use this for many years to come. There will be more videos of this coming shortly. So I hope you enjoyed this review of the Dyson V12 Detect Slim Cordless Vacuum and I'll see you next time.